Hello everyone, how's it going my net friends? My name is Miguel Sanchez, welcoming you to another episode of Logo History. Today, we are on episode 12 of the series, as we are taking a look at USA Network. Cable, this is your network. America, this is your cable network. This is your USA Network. Here's a jump reference you don't know what USA Network is. USA Network, on air at USA. Stylized as USA 2005, is an American basic cable channel that is owned by the NBC Universal Television and Streaming Division of NBC Universal, a subsidiary of, of Comcast. It was originally launched in 1977 as Madison Square Garden Sports Network, one of the first national sports cable television channels before being relaunched as USA Network in 1980. Once a minor player in basic tier paid television, USA has steadily gained popularity due to its original programming. It is one of the four major subscription television networks with TBS, TNT, and FX that also broadcast syndicated reruns of current and former network television, i.e. terrestrial, series and theatrical release feature films, as well as in limited sports programming at WWE. As of September 2018, USA Network is available to about 94.4% million households, or 98% of households with paid television in the U.S. That's everything you need to know about USA Network. Now let's get into the local history of USA Network. Uh, 1977 to 1980, uh, we have, uh, what do we have? We have 14, uh, black shapes forming an arena. Yeah, we have 14 black shapes forming an arena. Under those shapes, there are the words Madison Square Garden and Network, all in black text under. Under the word network, there's a, uh, black line. The word mad uh, the word Madison is above the word square, the word square is above the word garden, the word garden is above the word network, and the word network is above that black line. That's all the rest of it. Um nineteen eighty to nineteen ninety six, the uh, Madison Square Garden Sports Network was rebranded as USA Network. So we have the word USA in uh red text and under it is the word network in blue text. Here's the cable network version. Nineteen ninety six to nineteen ninety nine, um uh, we just have the words you we have the word USA black text under it, there's a word network also in black text. Also on the left of the word USA there is a blue star. Kind of funny, is it? Anyways, um, 1999 to 2003, um, uh, we have the word USA in, uh, blue text, and, uh, on the right, and on the right of it, there's a 3D version of the USA flag, transparent to be exact. Also, under everything, there's a word network in blue text. Um, 2003 to 2006, the font has changed, and now there are only five stripes instead of seven, and all the logo, and everything is now darker. Here is the red version. And finally, 2005 to the present, we just have the word USA in black text with all letters connected, and the letter S is in a negative space, and the letter S is in a negative space, and under the letter A, there's a word network in, blue, in black text. And here's the alternative version, the uh, blue version, the uh, version with their former slogan, characters welcome, the uh, HD version, the on-screen bug, the green version used for Green Universal, the orange version, the version inside a uh, light blue square, for the version used for USA Sports, and finally the red version. All right, thanks for watching this episode of Logo History. Hope you guys enjoy it yourselves. I've been Miguel Sanchez, you being yourself. We hope you guys had a lot of fun. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so that way you never miss an episode. And I guess that's pretty much it for today. Hey, don't forget to subscribe to you, never miss a video. All right, see you next time for another episode of Logo History, everybody. Oh, and uh, why you at it? Go get me some pop tarts, won't you? Anyways, make sure you come back again, again next time for episode 13, which is about Telemundo, America's second l most watched Spanish language television network. So, you don't want to miss it. We'll see you for episode 13 on Telemundo very soon. For all of us in local history, I'll be going to I'll see you in the next one. Laters.